is ready to be dropped on this one. James Sabolski, Ray Ferraro, so glad you could join us for this EA Sports Hockey League matchup. Teams lined up in the middle. We are ready to get things underway. Well, the hype for this one has been off the hook. Puck is dropped. Let's see if this one actually lives up to it. From the right side, takes the pass. And now he angles it across to Fisher. Swing and a miss. The Comets gain control of the puck against the wall. Quick feed down low. Blocked in traffic. Puts it on net and makes the save. Sends one up to Bissonette. Along the half wall with the puck. Lays into the body. Trying to dump it out. And it's taken by a teammate and stays in. Sends it over. Cincinnati's got it behind the net. Tries to get the puck over to Bissonette. Drouin's got the puck. Big time defensive play. Passes it to Al. The Cyclones gain possession in their own end. Carries it across the line. Here's a shot, and that one's stopped. Owls won it in their own end. Cincinnati's gained possession along the boards. Taken down, and the officials caught it. Puts it on net, and that's blocked away. There's the stoppage of play. Let's see what the officials say. Tripped him up, and he's off to the box for it, Ray. Reaching out for the puck, you get your stick into his feet. This is the consequence. Well, this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. Easiest thing in the world, James. Tell somebody else to relax. The power play hasn't scored yet. They're not relaxed, and it's not easy to do, but that's the key to success. Here's a short pass to Yandel. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Fort Wayne's got a hold of the puck. Trying to get it out. And it stays in. That's a solid check on the play. And he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. Cincinnati's looking to break out of their own end. Throws one up to Keith. Picks off the pass. And he regains control of the puck. Keith's going to play it against the half wall. Stopped by the goaltender. The Cyclones fire blanks on the power play. We're back to even strength here. Pretty hard to have a more low-intensity power play than that. It really didn't generate a thing. And when you don't generate much, you're sure not going to score. Puck is dropped and play resumes. They gain possession here inside the neutral zone. Centered out in front, and he gets a paddle on that one. And now he passes up to Bissonette. Over the line they come. Moves the puck down low, and that's taken by the defense. Grabbed along the board by Yandel. Great pass from off the right side. Fort Wayne's got control of it now from their own end. his own face off and he wins the draw denied by the goaltender Cincinnati's got a hold of it along the wall and that's blocked slides the puck down low jostling for the puck and he loses control that's a solid hit Cincinnati's got the puck along the wall Dyke has got it against the boards and that one's broken up and now he moves it quickly to Jack and forces a huge turnover here with the steal. He clearly doesn't like that. 
Fisher's not so sure about the weight class here. He says no thanks. Keith's got it in the defensive end. Stays with it. Now over to Fisher. And now it's grabbed by Drouin. Stopped by the goaltender. Deke has shown a lot of heart here. It takes a lot of courage and gumption to finish a shift when you're injured. We hope that he's okay. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Carries it in. Back on a stick now. Cincinnati's got the puck along the boards. Quick pass to Drouin. And he easily stops that one. Right up the gut. Here they go. Puck scooped up by Yandel. Deep inside the defensive zone, trying to clear the puck. A chance in front, and that one's broken up. With the stop. Smothered that in close chance. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. You'll need more than that to beat him. Fisher's got the puck now in his own end. Picked off. Tried to be too cute on the pass. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Off the draw and a nice job. He scores! Nice. What a goal! Oh, this is an outstanding deep. I don't know if you've been watching video of what Sidney Crosby does, but he imitates him perfectly here. Lays the move on the goaltender, gets to the backhand, and puts it away. Puts it to the front of the net. Shot shuts him down. Save is good. Better yet that that rebound doesn't stay in front of the net. It's over to safety in the corner. What a steal in his own end. The offensive player with the lead. You gotta be sure with the puck. You can't turn it over in that spot. Big stop just as time expires in the period. Horn sounds, and that concludes the first 20 minutes of play. We've got a one-nothing game here after the first 20 minutes of play. the tunnels we'll take a quick breath ourselves and be back for the second period period. We've got a 1-0 hockey game thus far. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Quick feed to Al. Takes a hit. He goes down to the ice and toss up the puck. Moves it to Bissonette. Gets down to knock it away. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Here they are on the attack. Takes the feed and tries to make a diagonal pass to Drouin. Moves it around along the half wall. Takes the bump and loses control of the puck. Look out, a two-on-one. Takes the puck into the corner of the offensive end. 
Moves it quickly over to Bissonette. Sends a pass over. Unloads it, and it comes up with the save. Cincinnati's been the more aggressive team offensively, and they continue to lead here in the second. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. The Comets get a hold of the puck in their own end. Lacks it into the offensive zone. Fort Wayne's got a hold of it against the wall. Sends it ahead to Jack. There's the whistle, icing the call. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he comes up with it. Handles the puck. Yandel's got it along the wing. And there's the save. Oh, great play to use the wall handling the pass. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Sends it across. Doesn't go. Takes a wrist shot off the post. Fort Wayne's ability to get back in this game is going to rely. Scores! We're all tied up! And now their bench has a little more belief as they've evened up the score. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. And they send it right back to him. Laying the body. Sent into the offensive zone. Sends the pass over. Puck picked up in the open ice. Picked off in the open ice. Regains possession at center. Here's a short pass to Jack. Stopped by the blocker. From the top of the offensive zone here. Gets down to block it. Hammers a shot. Denies him with a save. Quick pass to Al. They've got numbers. Slides it across. And that's broken up. Scoops up the puck now. Now he slides it up to Bissonette. Hammers a shot just wide. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Moves it ahead from off the wall. Easily turned away with a glove. More than half the frame has been played here. It's all tied up. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Lugs the puck into the corner of the offensive zone. The Cyclones look to start the transition game. Yandel stick handling in his own zone. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. And he gets down to block it. The Comets have it from their own end. And we've got a two on one. Comes up with a steal. And now he tries to get it across to Bissonette. Takes the feed at the point. Fort Wayne's gained possession along the boards. Drives it to the front of the net. And a beautiful stop by the glove. He makes the glove stop right from the slot. That's a dangerous chance. Getting into the later stages of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Denied by the goaltender. Oh, here we go. You know the crowd will love to see this. Here. Yeah, well, look at this, James. I mean, when the goalie's involved, everybody feels an extra layer of what the heck is going on. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And that one's broken up. Quick feed to Jack. Offside the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the blue line. This neutral zone face-off set to go, and we are back underway. Icing is called, stopping the play dead. Bissonette's won a big draw on their own end. With the stop. Good save. Positional save through traffic. There's another stop. Right in the open ice. That one's picked off. Moves the puck. 
Cincinnati's gained possession. This has been a heck of a shift for them. They've got them hemmed into the offensive zone. Now they can carry the puck around as the defenders are just... Scores! And the deadlock is broken! Well, what a crushing goal to give up. But the other guys worked hard for it. They pressed the play, and now they've got the lead. Once he gets in that close, you know it's going to be a deke. He sells the shot, though. The goalie bites on it, and he goes to the forehand. Makes no mistake to put it in the net. The Cyclones are readying themselves for the face-off here now with a one-goal lead. This late in the second period, they should consider themselves fortunate and just want to get into the intermission with this cushion. Hard sounds bringing the second period to an end. So two periods in the books, and it's 2-1. should be a very intriguing third. done a wonderful job putting a lot of pucks on net and they lead it early in this third period nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone and that goes off a player in front big hit solid hit on that play here's an opportunity to get the puck out of their own end and he's able to move the puck across the blue line and out of harm's way takes it at center play whistle dead because of an offside Cincinnati's turned good defense into good offense as they lead it early in this third period. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. Grabs control of it at the point. On the attack along the boards. Can't get it to go. Can't get a hold of that pass. And the linesman calls icing on the play. We're still in the early stages of this period. We've got a 2-1 game. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. And there's the save. And a nasty whack after the whistle here. Yeah, he went after him pretty good there. That's a hard slash. The Cyclones lead this one early in the third period. They have been the more aggressive team offensively with the lead in the shot department. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Moves it to Keith. That's moved up ahead. The 360 with the puck. And sends it just out of reach. Taken by Keith. Fisher's moving the puck through his own zone. Oh, and a good heads-up defensive play. He grabs the puck here at the point. On the backhand in front. He scores! They didn't sit back after getting that first one. They piled a back-to-back goal on here. Oh, this is an outstanding deep. I don't know if you've been watching video of what Sidney Crosby does, but he imitates him perfectly here. Lays the move on the goaltender, gets to the backhand, and puts it away. Puts the puck on net. Puck picked up by Yandel. Gets it out of his own end. Grabs the puck at center. With possession along the wall. 
Fort Wayne's got the puck now. Here they come on the attack. Here's the pass. Feeds it down low. Grabs the puck and looks to make something happen. Moves it quickly over to Drouin. Jack's got the puck now here inside his own defensive zone. The Comets gain possession in their own end. And that one's stolen at center ice. Moves the puck along the half wall. And he loses control of the puck. Keeling swooping in on the attack. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Takes the pass. Fort Wayne's got the puck along the boards. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Rocked on the play. With the bank pass. With some momentum driving towards the net. Makes the save. Nice defensive robbery with the stick. He scores! Three goals. The hat trick's in the bag. Here come the hat. What a great feeling. It's just places jumping. Cincinnati's having a lot of fun out there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Truway has got it in the offensive zone. Battling for it along the boards. Sends the pass down low. The Comets gain possession along the wall. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. Cincinnati's offense has been the story tonight, leading big time here in this third period. And play resumes as the puck has dropped. Cincinnati's got it in their own zone. Along the half wall with the puck. From his own end, he picks up the puck. And a poke check knocks the puck away. Good heads up play to knock it away. Takes the shot. Oh, so close. Close enough that that's just a couple inches away from being a goal. Cincinnati's got a hold of it along the wall and manages to clear the zone. Here's a short pass to Bissonette. Great timing to come up with the interception. Fort Wayne's got the puck along the wall. From the point, looks to make something happen. Denied by the blocker. Whoa. Wait, they're signaling a goal. It, it looked like he had it, but it looks like they're signaling a goal. The Cyclones have been enjoying Pad the stat night here. It's been going all night long here, even in the third. They came to play tonight. They have not let their opponent breathe, and it has been a dominating performance. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Takes the feed. Cincinnati's got a hold of it against the wall. Gets it out of his own end. He's in that size are looking for three. He's got two in his back pocket. Dangerous player now. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Cincinnati's gained possession along the boards. And now it's over to Jack. Puck knocked loose after that hit. Takes it across the blue line. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. No, he's trying to dangle there, but he loses the puck. Now he's got to chase it back. Jocelyn for the puck, and it's knocked away. And makes the save. Really good puck control by the goalie as he gets it out of danger. Big play inside the defensive zone. And player hauled down to the ice. Looks like we got a tripping penalty coming up here. Dyke is getting called for tripping. Nice calling him out. Did he ever? This is, this is going to get heated. Al's won it off the faceoff. Cincinnati's got the puck along the boards. Scores! Putting the power in power play. Did just about everything right on that man advantage. They capitalized. The Cyclones are in the home stretch of this one, leading big time in the third. Some pushing and shoving here, heating up. Yeah, the few words lead to a little bit more, it looks like. Here's a shot. Blocker saved by the goalkeeper. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. Every once in a while, everything comes together for a complete victory. And I felt that's what happened tonight. They had the puck, they shot the puck, they got it back, they shot it again. Really a dominating performance. You know, I know people like to point the finger at goaltenders when they give up lots of goals. But in this case, it's hard to blame him with the amount of offense that he was seeing there. Well, there's no way he's going to be able to hold the door shut. That was domination. And that'll do it for Ray Pearl. I'm James Sabalski. Thank you.